Hey Ballers, it's Horton. It's been a while, uh, a lot going on, but I'm at my new lake here in uh, Northern California and I have a box from the good folks at Masterline. So let's see what Russell and crew sent me. Lucky knife, you know the shtick. Jeff Gaster, you're the man. It's hot out here today. Got in a couple ski rides, working on a ski review. Good stuff going on. All right. Box open. What do we have in here? We have a brand new beautiful handle, which a brand new beautiful handle, which is the first thing I saw, but what they really sent me, what they really want to show you, or what want me to show you, is this handle guard. So, um, there have been a lot of iterations of this, a lot of homemade stuff over the years, and this is Masterline's take on it. So, let me get a little closer here. So, this thing is mesh, so it's not going to catch wind, and it's not super rigid, but it's rigid enough and it's not gonna get in the way. I've skied with handle guards uh, off and on for years. I'm stoked about this. I'm gonna, I'm legitimately, this is my new handle. This is what I'm gonna run every day. And they sent me an extra one. So um, what's cool about this is you can just buy the handle guard, and I've never done this before, I'm making it up on the fly, which shouldn't surprise you, is it's just Velcroed. Yep, as I thought. So if you order one of these from Masterline, you put it on your handle, and I don't know if I'm going to take this thing all the way apart. I'm not, but it's not rocket science. I can see it here. All right. So, cool. Velcro's on and off. Uh, you're going to be safer. You know, uh, we haven't had a lot of deaths in water skiing, but it's happened. Um, I know a guy. Some of you know a guy. Um, so, I encourage you, use a handle guard. Get it from Masterline. Uh, also, I just want to say on a side note, how cool is this rope? I asked for this, uh, I forget what they call this, uh, this color of rope, but I really dig it. And uh, while I'm rambling, if your hands hurt, use a bigger handle. I know that's kind of off topic here, but uh, this is a 1.062. It's kind of a bigger diameter handle. Uh, that's why my hands don't look like a bloody mess. Back in the day, we all ran uh, 1.0 handles. No, 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 no. In fact, that second handle guard is going to go on my even bigger handle, also a master line, which is a 1.125. So I encourage you to have multiple handles with multiple diameters. It's easier on your tendons and stuff. Put a handle guard on all of them. That's all I got. Thank you, guys.